Hey everybody, it's Dave Juno, the Meniere's Disease Warrior. You know what's funny? I, it's been such a bad day. I had brain fog, and I forgot. To, I just did a video, and I just forgot to turn the microphone on. Because um, <laughs> I figured maybe it'll take away some of the echoey in here, in uh, the new office. So, um, how you all doing? I had an extremely rough night last night, so we'll just get to down to brass tacks. Um, so went to bed. You know, felt fine yesterday. If you guys saw my video on um, loneliness, yeah, I had a great day yesterday. Um, no problems. Uh, you know, today I was going to rest anyways, but it was no problem. So, you know, I went to bed, I don't know, 10, 30, 11, maybe somewhere around there. A couple hours later, um, I wake up to the sound of a bell. Ding, 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 in my right ear. And not only was it a sound, I could actually feel it in the ear, you know? So I, I just was like, what the hell's going on? You know, my wife's work, sleeping. Uh, my son was sleeping. I went downstairs to make sure he was, wasn't doing something, which if he was, that's fine. At least I knew where it was coming from. Um, you know, because he sometimes can't sleep and he does whatever projects he's doing in the workroom down there. Um... So I, you know, made sure he was okay. The dogs were fine. There was nobody outside. I, I'm just like, man, what the hell's going on? And this went off in like an hour or so, maybe even longer. And, you know, I know it's some type of, of tinnitus, but I, I just was like, whoa, I have never experienced this before in my life. So I was up pretty much most of the night thinking, how could this be? And looking stuff up. And then finally I was like, you know, I'm just confusing myself. Um, I'm going to go back to bed. And it was about 5.30. And then I, you know, by that time, the no it had gone away in just a normal high-pitched squeal or the roaring that I, deal that I could deal with normally. So I was like, okay, I'll go back to bed. You know, it's 5.30. I don't got nowhere to go today. It's raining. You got a snowstorm coming, whatever. Rainstorm. Um, so I'm back to bed. And then I woke up. With this is how I can put it with Meniere's and not, you know, like a uh, what do you call it? A phenomenon or a ghost or whatever. Um, because I woke up with the worst vertigo I've had in a long time. Literally, I was uh, wall walking, uh, fell the whole nine yards. Um, you know, but you know, as I was waking up, it was getting better, better. And I tried to tough it out, but then around noon time, it just I, I crashed. So I, you know, I talked, I took a Valium, and I crashed. And I just woke up about well, maybe an hour and a half ago. But you know, I wanted to know if you guys have ever experienced something like that with a a bell, a bell sound, you know, like a front desk bell, ding 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 ding. Um, because I'd really love to know just for my own sanity and. And maybe it's something new that we can, I can add to list to, to, to my doctor. I've already wrote it down in the journal. So um, I can message him or I can, you know, wait till I see him in June. Um, or July, I'm sorry, July. So um, I've got that taken care of. But if you experience something like that, please let me know in the comments. Um, comments in the video, comments on Facebook. Please let me know. I'm very curious to see if anyone else has ever experienced this before. Um, and, you know, this is a YouTube channel about my, you know, my experiences. But you know what? I answer your questions and sometimes I ask questions. And if you can answer them, that's awesome. Because even though it's my vlog, this is a community thing. And we're all part of a community. Okay. And, and I think that's some of the things that people get hung up on about my channel. Um, because they think I'm, I'm just trying to get subscribers to make money, and that's not what I'm doing. I've said it a thousand times. We're all one big community. You know? I mean, yeah, there's, there's you know, 20, 30 Facebook support groups. And like I said yesterday in, 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 the, in the video, nobody's trying to steal members. It's just the more avenues you have for support, the better off you can be, and the answers you can get, and things you can try, and, and this and that, you know? Um, you know, and, and this is one thing I am going to plead to all the admins out there, you know, whatever, um, happens in the past, the way we used to do things, 
let's change that okay because we seriously are one big community nobody is making a million dollars on how many um, members they have in a group I don't get paid for my group so here's a challenge let's just open everybody up you know admins let's talk to each other let past be the past and we all move forward because then we can get more exposure more <coughs> excuse me I've still got that thing uh, cold um, you know we can get more exposure more awareness faster maybe a faster way of so we can live our lives functional and not be tortured so on that note hey you know we're all in this together so there are better days coming I'm gonna end the video I don't want to make a long one and I will talk to you all soon take care everybody and remember there are better days coming I'm still smiling even though I feel like shit <laughs> we're all adults so I can say shit um, yeah I'm still smiling even though I feel like shit so on that note bye everybody take care